Ladies and gentlemen, apologies for the delay, but welcome back, Penn State Baron Esports. Time for you, we have another exciting game. You said a doubleheader, Penn State Baron, playing for the second time tonight. Going to be up, they're going to go up against Southern Arkansas University, a team they have faced before. We get to right. Um. Boom, boom. The Narta starting on red side. Penn State starting on blue. I believe that last time Penn State and Narta went up against each other, Penn State managed to take it. But that all in all doesn't mean anything. Here in the playoffs, teams have had chances. Who on the way adapt, you know, work on their cohesion as a team, but better comps basically just improve. And that added desperation of, you know, being in the playoffs, every game meaning so much. Baron, both teams actually already plenty warmed up. They both had a chance to play tonight. Okay, nice early kill. It wasn't me. B5 is up. That's going to be another pick. Pirate is down. Give Baron some nice pushing power. Try to take control of well. Trying to bail out. Manages to escape. Does Baron take control of the point? Initial control is Baron's. That doesn't mean it's a Nurkatsu's willing to slow down. So much dive between the Reaper, the Winston. Ooh, Seth gets caught, but he's still hanging on. Pirate manages to catch Oris. And, and it wasn't me, already has the primal rage up. Everybody takes that wood. It wasn't me, clears the last survivors. They're in a very awkward spot. Forced to fight their way all the way back to the objective that is just gradually ticking more and more progress for Southern Arkansas. Pirate getting a flank. Whatever behind getting right on top of purple. Purple not even reacting. Seth takes out it wasn't me. There's a death blossom. Does cancel that rip tire. Seth. Let's stop to it before it does too much damage. Pirate though. Still on the warpath. Here's a pick on Orisk for being finished off. Just catches wood and gets purple. And poor purple can take out ordinary. Again. In the push is the coalescence. Death guns down wasn't me with that whole hog. Forcing the other defenders off the objective. Whoever gets the revive off when it wasn't me. The nasty flank coming in. Purple mage take up pirate. He just staying mobile. Purple gunning with me down. Catch his strawberry and Baron mage take control of the objective. Losing his skin. Ordinary manages to get out. The artillery strike from purple. That was a funky hook on pirate. Ooh! <laughs> that puts him in the ground. Beautiful hook! We we already know. Seth is nice and warmed up with these hog hooks on Ilios. Ooh, trying to... got to... <laughs> I play happy feet. Okay, takes out strawberry. Purple finishes off pirate. Baron's getting gradual progress here, 60%. Love chance for environmental kills. Between that Orissa and Lucio, very dangerous spot. 
like, okay, that one didn't quite work out, but I saw what he was going for. And what terrifies me is that it almost worked. The Narcotel looking at their final chance to contest this. The chair comes down. Doesn't do much to it, wasn't me. Trying to push Falcon to the pit, but he can't quite get it. Seth does land the hook, though. Pyro with a flank. Takes out Purple. He takes out Seth. Orsk burns him down with that Kamehameha. Seth is gone with Purple back on the field. He can cover the supports. Got to make sure he doesn't put his back to that pit. Give this... Trying to finish off Swood, but he can't quite. Over time is ticked, fair, 99%. Ooh, purple finally made to secure that kill in Abyss. Guy Impact doesn't do much. Seth forcing, it wasn't mean to the Abyss. Pirate Seth Blossom not doing enough. Aaron managed to take the first map. In our first game. Of course, so best three. Still go either way. Do 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 do. Baron, very confident in their picks, keeping that exact same comp. Meanwhile, plenty of switch arounds on the Dark Tail side. And up with an Ana and a Zarya. All right, moving forward, immediately getting hooked, forth to forced to Wraith mode out. A beautiful hook by Seth, dealing some serious damage to Seth, and just to escape. I'm just trying to put forward as much pressure as possible. Orisk of all people manages to secure that kill. Oh no! The hook and the sticky on Strawberry. They're gone. As he tries to run away, his Falcon secures the kill in Ordinary. Kind of harassed but wants to build up that charge. Patience on Baron though. Not giving them a single point. Probably managed manage to take out Abyss. Trying to take control. Beautiful hook by Seth. Burrow finishes the job a triple. Baron wiped the point. Getting more and more upset now. Southern Arkansas is going to try and. Going to have to try and punch through. Baron's defense, defense here isn't as much of a brick wall as it is as rubber, you know? Not necessarily staying in one exact place. Willing to bend a bit, but it's far from breaking. Pyra managed to secure that kill on Falcon. Up down with the Death Blossom. The big anti on Seth. Pyra gets a third. Falcon evening up the scoreboard, though. You get double there. Ooh. Pellets just barely finish him off. Orisk with the coalescence catches Strawberry Pearl Clay Pigeon Stub is Pirate though getting a double. Beautiful support from Ordinary with those antis. It's turn to make Rudge back. Oh no, Strawberry gets caught and burnt down. That chasing pirate doesn't want to risk that level of burst damage coming from behind and biting them. Nice, nice little uh, graviton from what's me. Set quick to respond, pops the whole hog, forcing was me back. 70% now. 
The Naruto is running out of time. I sidestep on the hook from Pirate. Purple screws killing it. it wasn't me. Using your tank. The big loss here, but with that anti-pirate trying to chase Seth down. Moving on, moving on. Ready to pop that Death Blossom. Pearl manages to shut him down before he can hit the button. The nano boost accidentally falling to Strawberry. They do whatever they can to hold the to hold this point, but it's too little, too late. Barrett managed to take the first game over Southern Arkansas. All right. A little stint there. Waiting for the map pick for our second game. We're seeing a bit of a substitution on the Arkansas side. We got to our second map, our hybrid map, Umbani. Ooh, okay. Is everyone really gonna Ike involved instead? I just I love Ike involved. Reminds me of uh back with the uh the big active support for Overwatch One Times. Honor and glory and all the all the super sick stuff coming out whenever a map came out. Mm. Good times. I think both sides are ready. I'm done reminiscing. And we're seeing a side swap. So let me. Do, do. Boom. 
Here we go. Oh jeez, it looks like it's a side swap. Um the spectating members on the SAU side were left on red side. We'll say very good posterity from Wasn't Me immediately calling that out before anything happening. Yeah. You're being competitive. You're here to play honest. And now it's the evening. We had to fly back we had to fly back into the lobby and then fly back out here and time has passed <laughs> mild amount of tomfoolery Baron starting an attack Alright, getting a nice little helix rocket off there right out the gate. Great ship can't quite get a kill. Where? Okay, the abyss is going for the flank. That damage boost made just clearly kill on purple in the chaos. So you playing this squirrely, even Baron on their toes. Working out so far. Purple gets caught again in the crossfire. That's a that was a very nice fade by Orisk. Get caught by pirate though. Pirate just firing into the crowd. Some comp switch ups. The Guardian Angel from Bigswood. This response to the artillery strike. Can't quite catch anyone, does some good damage. Ooh! Ordinary bird is caught by that railgun. Knots follows and turns. Hey, that's the thing. Seth, Seth is every kind of sniper a hook sniper and, you know, a standard one with an actual rifle. Baron to take control of that payload. We've got to push. The damage being set up by SAU. Death though, in all the chaos, keeping it cool, landing those shots where they where he needs to. It's a piss. Neck is down. Fucking pops that self destruct just to force SAU to back off. I remain to return the favors, curing kill on Seth. Result takes out Swood. Fucking is down. Nice nades by purple. Can't quite get a kill though. Tire is up. There's the rip tire. Being squirrely. 
Spotted waiting it out. No one to catch. Falcon forces forward. Thinking out it wasn't me catching knots after the eject. Not still managed to get that revive off. The tack visor from on high. That's three. That four. Beautiful flank. Great use of that ulti. Push them back. Baron get, gets forced back. Ooh, nice shots by Seth. Ordinary is down. That's a chance! Popping the ult. Catches the Biz. Catches not. That's that's three. Beautiful from Seth. Finding that needle. Needle in a haystack shot and immediately running away with it. Tell Falcon really wants to do something saucy. Really wants to set up that diva bomb. Fighting the temptation. Here is the alt. Doris, there's the diva bomb. The no abyss and it wasn't me. We're outside of the invuln. Fucking pearl, cleaning up. Are trying to contest. It's not enough, Baron, to manage to push this cart too. First checkpoint. Three minutes left to make it the last of the way through the castle. The attack visor by Pirate. Moving up. Catches Orisk. Down. Down with that helix rocket. Takes out Pearl. Then keeps him on the keeps him on the field. Falcon tries to rush him down. It's not gonna put the attack visor. Nice and mobile during the reload. So you managed to pivot this fight. Forcing Baron back. Bit of a comp change by Baron. Give over to Winston. Interesting pick. Purple getting a nice, quick pick on Pirate. Seth follows it up by taking out Knots. And Seth will secure another. Doesn't mean torn apart. Baron gonna get some nice distance here. Got to switch. Pirates on Reaper. Oh, Reap the mode's over to go. Seth catches a double. Make that a triple. Oh my gosh, these flicks. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Purple trap caught ordinary. It really looked like... It really looked like Seth just hit the, the meanest flick shot of the century. All right. Now it's SAU's turn to push. See if they can rival Baron's progress. The echoes of last game here. The last game that SAU, that SAU played against Baron. Last game tonight for those who caught it.
parents playing this stuff, kind of thinking about doing similar cheeky forward uh, push and kind of thing that SAU opens up with. Pirate, you get a wide flank around the left on Farah. Stay unknown factor for as long as possible. Getting a beautiful flank around. Just start capping. Good sees him. Baron immediately pivot around, stopping. Capture of a tick. Nods dies as well. Beautiful turnaround. Beautiful execution by Baron. Immediately understanding what was happening. Executing. Perfectly by the book. And now, now, keeping an eye to the sky. All right, life grip to safety. Shots by Seth. Abyss. Just Falcon. Pirate blows himself up. Ordinary takes out purple. It was me running right alongside Ordinary. Life Weaver all. Bob's on the field. Eric does manage to take out Seth, but Bob is contesting! Bob gets CC'd onto the objective. Counting as a teammate, contest the point. Fucking rushes in and batters down Ordinary. I don't think Baron's gonna be able to retake this, but they are gonna be able to lead out a little bit of time, at least, on SAU side. You take control of the point. Now we're playing payload. The things out ordinary. Mean rip that. This is just petty. Doesn't even get it on not. That's moving up. The rocket barrage set things out. Purple bites it as well, so it's still even. Ooh, nice shot placement by Seth. Those critical hits. That's burns down. And ordinary burns up. It just wasn't me as well. Pirate stepping back. Throwing some rockets. Ooh, almost dies to that biotic orb. Ooh, I said, Coach Gunning, it was me. Now nah, get out of here. <laughs> All right, rotating around, trying to catch him. Just get the kill. Big falls as well. Meanwhile, on the objective, Pyre managed to get a triple. Forest can purple, though. Clear the rest of Southern Arkansas. Payload is going anywhere. All right, playing this bit dangerous. Bob rushes onto the field. Does get slept. All right, takes the Orisk. Finishing off Pirate. Bigfoot flies back to revive Orisk. Okay, pops the Ramatra alt. They should take out Ordinary. SAU has two minutes left to push.
He's down here. The artillery barrage. Fist can't quite escape it. Under a minute and a half left. They're doing a beautiful job holding this line. Plenty of vaults coming up on both sides, though. Fist switching over to Bastion. This is me taking a hell of a lot of damage, still hanging on. I'm getting a little cocky looking to pivot that fact because it wasn't me. gets hit by that nano boost. No graviton, but it's still going to be a lot of damage. That they managed to catch a frag on ordinary. Through the Katsune rush. Pirates on the Reaper. It's burned down by Bob. It wasn't me. It doesn't really take out Orisk. The biscuits would. Baron still are dismantling Southern Arkansas. This neck deep in enemy territory. Just catching a beautiful pick on Nazis. Not going to be here for this last fight. Ooh. Falcon does get hit by the anti. Gets hit by the sleep, but the Ramatra ult is already up, burning down ordinary. Purple gets wasn't me. Seth catches pirate with nobody to contest. That's gonna be clean for Baron. They're standing over Southern Arkansas 2-0, threatening to oh, 2-0, <laughs> threatening to knock them out of the easy easy playoffs. Yeah, no, absolutely. This was play. Death Sojourn is just nuts. That's one. Two. Three. Four. Oh yeah, that just was a penna. Okay, cool. Sick. for a pure payload map of the night we're looking at havana oh no never mind nuts calling out dorado i keep being too quick with these call outs
All right, looks like we'll, we're hopping into our third and potentially final game. If Baron can keep this up, then Arkansas is risking being knocked out of the ECAC playoffs, but they've made it this far. Arkansas have made it to the playoffs. They've earned their spot. They won their game right before this, just like Baron has. They absolutely have the capacity to turn this around. Can't count them out yet. Okay. Again, Penn State Baron opening on attack. I was trying to tell what song Big Spoon was trying to play on the bells for a sec. Placement by Pirate. For a chance to dive onto Baron. Wasn't me catching Orisk. Forced to fall down. Managed to make it back into spawn. Seth protects his support. It wasn't me. Batters down per purple. I do the same as wood, but beautiful movement. Just stepping up. Just barely manages to escape. Falcon clearly doesn't want to let that happen. That's diving on. Managed to take a pirate. Doesn't me. Catch his Oris. Falcon falls as well. Very, very revives pirate. Pirate hit by a whole lot of burst, forced to fall back. Just playing around this corner, catching a pick on Strawberry. That's huge. Building energy off that barrier. Oh no! Abyss is down. Beautiful teleporter. There's the Kitsune rush. And that Ramatra alt from was it me? Kind of force Baron's back line. Gonna spawn. Finish take out it wasn't me as pirate finishes off Falcon. No tanks this fight. The Death Blossom catches Pearl and Oris, but Seth finishes them off. Shoots knots out of the air. Strawberry flies in, managed to get the revive off on it wasn't me. Me hits the ground running, taking out both Seth and Swood. I'm talking about it. SAU playing a lot of that fire that we just haven't been seeing these last few games. Now their backs against the wall. Really willing to put everything out there. Oh, Falcon rushing in with that Ramacha alt. Burns down Pirate. And just take out Abyss. Go listen to Pop for Morris. Finishing off Strawberry. Purple switched over to Reaper himself. Also on Rat King. That's going to be confusing. Managing to chase down Knots. Falcon takes out Pirate. They're trying to force the defenders back as far as they can. Miss manages to dink out pur Purple. Too late. Payload's already made it to the checkpoint. Three and a half minutes left. Trying to hold the line. Not to take Sadoris. Barely hanging on. Barely still is. And Arkansas doing a beautiful job forcing Baron to pay for every single inch in blood. 
Because me pops through a monster ult, Tsunami Rush comes out. The JoJo Rush! Falcon is down. The Death Blossom from Purple it catches not to catch it was me. Oris swings that fight, taking out Abyss. And they're making more and more progress. Does get life pirate does get life crypt away still caught in that dynamite. The Reapers are fighting. Baron to get up below the slowly push that cart. There's the Death Blossom. Just barely doesn't secure a single kill. Purple TP's up to follow. Seth finishes the job. Everybody popping that. Climbing the tree of life. Slow down Falcon's push. Purple managed to finish Strawberry off. Rushing in. Seth is. Er, Abyss is down. Knots is down. Wasn't me follows. As does Pirate. Baron managed to hit that second checkpoint. Just under three minutes left. Make it to the end of the map. Insane damage from the, with that damage with Seth. He's got Napalm. Really hanging on. Here comes. Was it me with. The Ramatra alt, purple does get slept, but he catches Abyss and Pirate out with that Death Blossom. Ooh. Purple coming out of that rhythm mode managed to catch knots. He's gonna TP out. Regroup and push up. Being a nice early pick on Abyss. The anti nade on Falcon, but he manages to hold on. Is there a Macho alt? Doesn't mean he doesn't have his own alt, but he does have a nano boost. Falcon forcing the desperate defenders back. Fair to manage to push the entirety of the map. Just under a minute, 59 seconds. Nerd is gonna have to do the same. Three, two, one. Attackers 
All right, the narc SAU's turn. Push that payload. I think this Winston pick again. Almost catches Wood. Purple managed to take him out. Beautiful body blocks. Not letting Pirate get to Wood despite the fact he was under half health. Wait, he touched Strawberry. The fist falls as well. They're setting the tone beautifully. Remember, we saw a we saw a similar beautiful initial hold from Southern Arkansas. It's, all, it's an endurance round. It's all about whether or not Bear can keep this up. Does it meet? Burns out. Got by Seth. Pirates. Pirate knots are all falling. A, a, a beautiful team wipe by Baron. Back to back. Not giving SAU a single inch. As that payload slowly slides back down the hill. Dink, dink, dink down. Purple hops down to finish the job. Strawberry gets caught out in the open by Seth. Gets it down. Beautiful clear by Baron again. Taking out the final attackers. Two minutes left. And so you've got to find their opening. This hill marks whether or not they continue the ECAC playoff season. Purple diving down, getting a beautiful Death Blossom out on Strawberry and Abyss. Falcon pops the Ramatra alt, annihilating knots. All right, getting a nice TP up. Being on top of Seth, that coach gun. Jumps in with the Death Blossoms. Wood and Seth are down. Oris and just to clean up the kill. Those are two still. Those are still two huge deaths for Baron to suffer. Falling back. First popping coalescence. Big mano boost on it wasn't me. Is the a result doesn't catch anyone. Purple gets bursted down. But Bob does the same to Seth. Strawberry's down as well. Robots on robots on robots on robots. Okay, takes out takes out the invol. Knots and Abyss fall soon after. Southern Arkansas is gonna have one more chance here. 30 seconds left. Got time to regroup. If they can win this fight. They might. Oh no! If they can get to that payload, they might be able to get to that checkpoint, keep this game going. But Baron is not going to let that happen without a fight. SAU running out of time. Ten seconds left. That's just peppering them any time they step out of the open. Wasn't me. Manages to touch, but not the strawberry fall. Abyss follows suit. Purple does get finished off by it. wasn't me, but it's a 2v4. He takes out Wood. Pirate is down. It wasn't me trying to hold the line. Caught by Seth. And just like that, Baron close it out against Southern Arkansas. 3 0. And they managed to win two games their night. Beautiful stuff. Beautiful set, everybody. Thank you so much for everybody who decided to tune into this later night stream. Really do appreciate that. Thank you to Southern Arkansas for gracing us with the game. Thank you to everybody who's supporting actively or passively. If you like your son, you're not following, and you want to keep up with Penn State Baron, make sure to give us a follow right here on twitch.tv slash Baron Esports. And if you didn't miss a stream and you want to catch one, 
Uh, follow us on youtube.com slash Barony Sports, where all of our vlogs will be uploaded in a week. Folks, thank you again so much for supporting me, supporting Pet State Barony Sports. Please be safe, be good to each other, stay warm, and have a fantastic night.